There are times when we face power outages when we have some important work to carry out online. Your home Wi-Fi does not run when there is no power in your house. To fix that issue, we will use the power of the sun to power our Wi-Fi. Let's get started. I will use this portable solar power system for this project. But it does not provide a 12 volt output, so we will need to boost it to the required voltage of the Wi Fi router. The necessary parts for this project will be in the description. I will remove the four screws holding the cover in place. The battery will be disconnected from the charging circuit. The circuit will be removed as well after taking out the two screws holding it in place. I will use the MT3608 boost converter to boost the battery voltage to 12 volts. I will then cut a small piece of copper perf board to hold the boost converter to the case of the solar power system. The boost converter will thereafter be mounted to the perf board. I soldered in some wires for the input and output of power to the boost converter and thereafter bridged the two contacts. I cut off the battery connectors of the charge controller so that I can join the input of the boost converter with it.
I soldered in the wires to new connectors. Afterwards, I crimped the connectors and used each ring tube to prevent any short circuit. I marked in holes necessary to mount the boost connot and the 12 volt output connector. I also made an opening to install a switch while I was at it. I spliced the negative wire of the input side of the boost converter to connect a switch to the circuit, allowing us to switch the boost converter as and when needed. I connected the output from the boost converter to the 12 volt female connector, paying attention to the polarity of the terminals. After the charge controller was installed back in place, the circuit was connected to the battery. We thereafter need a voltmeter in order to adjust the boost converter to output 12 volts. After making the proper connections, the small potentiometer needs to be turned several times to achieve the desired output. For the MT3608, you need to turn it counterclockwise to increase the voltage and vice versa. Once that's done, we can screw the cover back in place.
The Wi-Fi router will work even when there is no input power from the solar panel due to lack of sunlight as long as the battery holds charge. Thank you for watching and if you like the video please support the channel by subscribing and giving the video a thumbs up. See you in the next video.